What's up guys, it's Yazuki here and today we are going to install the PlayStation 3 emulator. So the PlayStation 3 emulator RPCS3 is downloadable from their official website and I will put the link of that website in the description down below. And the first thing you have to do is to go over to the download section and here you will download this game for Windows. Alright, and you click on this and you will download the zip file and I have already downloaded that so I'm not going to download it again. Alright, so you're going to extract the file to a new folder and in that folder you will find the emulator. Now, the emulator is not going to work yet because you actually need the firmware of the PlayStation 3 system. To do that, you go to the latest system software update of PlayStation 3, which I will also put down in the description below. And you just click download, you install that, I mean you download it, and right now, you once you've got that downloaded, it's a .pup file, you open up RPCS3, you go to tools, install firmware, and that's where you're going to install the .pup file. So. It's going to unpack this file and there you go, the libraries are installed. Now, what you have to do to play a game is go to this website, psndl.net, and this is where you can download your games. Now, watch out guys, because a lot of games are not yet supported, so what you have to do is look at the compatibility list on the RPCS3 website, which will show you a list with 2046 games which are playable or only in game but not considered totally playable or only the intro loadable or nothing so yeah check your game here first before you go ahead and type in the comments that your game is not working all right so today i am going to go with super street fighter there we go, and Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo HD Mix Remix is what we're going to play because this game is already supported pretty well by the PlayStation 3 emulator. First thing you have to do when you want to download your game is download the wrap file and then you go ahead and download the package file and once you've got those two you put the RAP file or the wrap file in the um, in this folder and then in the home folder then this weird folder and then in the X data folder that is where you're going to put that file and now the last thing you have to do is go to boot install package and click on the package file you've downloaded and it's going to unpack the game which is as you can see done very quickly by the emulator and then you double click and the game should open so uh, there we go the game has opened you can play your playstation 3 game on your pc right now so i hope this installation tutorial helped you and if it did don't forget to leave a like down below and if you want to see more videos like this from me in the future don't forget to subscribe see you guys